Hello everyone and welcome to From the Heart Friday, session 140 with me, Jessica Brigden of Jess B Creative Cardiology. Hello, hello, happy Friday to you. Thank you so much for joining. As you can tell, my setting is a little bit different. I'm actually coming to you live from Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. David had some work in Virginia as well as in Georgetown, South Carolina here. So we are at the beach for a couple days. And um, you can tell my hair is responding to the heat and the humidity and it's whew, <laughs> it's poofing, it's doing its own thing. But um, I didn't want to miss you guys. And so I wanted to make sure that uh, I caught on here for From the Heart Friday. And I have the perfect crafting kit for your beach escape or your beach adventure. And that is the A Little Smile card kit. And it does have the shrink wrapping on it. This is a brand new, um, one of the Stampin' Up's crafting kits that I have brought with me. I love it. It's just a perfect little size box. It is about the same size maybe just a little bit smaller than our paper pumpkin boxes. And the craft, um, craft kits are completely separate. You can buy them online. They are not found in the catalogs. Uh, they are different from paper pumpkin in that they are not a subscription. They are sold individually and Stampin' Up! has been introducing uh, just about one a month um, here for the last, last few months. And so I'm excited to share this one with you because it's a beach theme and it's got some seashells and fun things and I thought that would be really cute to share with you guys and I wanted to remind you too that I still have my uh, first week welcome to the new catalog special going on okay so we just got our brand new Stampin' Up! annual catalog went live on Tuesday and so for everyone that orders with me all month long if you order $50 um, or more, then your name will go on my 50, 50 board. So I've got 50 spots, $50 each. And so for every 50, you get a spot on my board. I will be doing drawings for free bundles as well as a free slim sayings bundle. So pretty exciting. All right, so you just have to place your order with me um, to get your name on the board there. And then for this week, so ending tomorrow, May 7th, if you order $65 or more, you will get my six card kit, all right? So you'll get supplies to make two each of these three designs of these gorgeous kits using Stampin' Up's Hues of Happiness bundle. That is on page 108 and 109 there of your annual catalog. And you wanna make sure you act fast. So to get my card kit, you can order anything. I do recommend the Hues of Happiness because I will not be including stamped images. And currently, this is one of the most popular items in the catalog and the happiness abounds dies the bundle the dies that go with this <laughs> bundle are currently on low inventory and once they go there is no back order anymore so once they go out of stock i don't know how long it will be before they're back in so make sure you place your order with me here um, by tomorrow and uh, take advantage of that piece of happiness special I have going on and you want to make sure you use my host code. I'll flip the camera so that it's right side up and you can see that. Hey Wendy, hey Janelle, hello, hello. No, I am not at home. Um, actually what you're seeing out the window behind me there is the Atlantic Ocean. All right, you see some strings are, there is some construction going on at the front of the building and I had originally planned to actually film from the beach um, except it is super windy so it has been hot and humid like 86 degrees and 90 plus percent humidity that's why my hair is like poosh and um, <laughs> it is very windy we're expecting some thunderstorms to pop in this evening but yes it is a gorgeous view um, here I'll just take a little detour and show you guys we are on the 15th floor. I know it's gonna get a little bit loud. It's, like I said, it's, it's windy out there. But there is the beach, that is Myrtle Beach. We have a great view. It's like super, super windy right now. All right. And my hubby is down there somewhere. He is working remote. He had a... Um, 
he had a client meeting this morning and then he's got some uh, online work he needs to do this afternoon. So he buzzed out on me. Maybe he'll join me next week when he is officially off. <laughs> we are hoping to um, have a couple of actual vacation days. We actually have a business meeting this evening as well as tomorrow. So this is an all play. We are, we have been <laughs> working a little bit too. Hi Doris. Hello everyone. Yeah, so that was Myrtle Beach <laughs> behind me. We are um, at the Landmark Resort. And if you want to come to Myrtle Beach and rent our place, uh, it's Unit 1536, the Landmark Resort. <laughs> I'll have to do a tour of that later. But yes, so I brought my a little smile um, Stampin' Up! crafting kit with me, and um, I thought that would be perfect for the beach. And I'm sorry I'm not doing it down there in the sand right now as I had planned. But like I said, I think everything would just totally blow away on me. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and flip the camera then, and um, hopefully I can try to still read your comments and see everything that's going on, and um, we'll make this fun kit. All right, let me go ahead and flip that. Okay, so that is a little bit easier. Okay, there is my host code. All right, 7X27K67C. All right, and so I was sharing that if you ordered $65 with me uh, by tomorrow, May 7th, you would get the kit to make two each of these three gorgeous Hues of Happiness cards. Okay, you do not have to have the stamp set to make them. Um, but I will not be including the stamped images, so you could substitute whatever you had. Um, of course, I think this bundle is absolutely gorgeous and you can actually get the entire collection um, for $69.50. So it's a great deal. Okay, so let's start with this a little smile card kit here. Like I said, these come, um, I think it's about the size of a paper pumpkin, maybe a little bit smaller. I am gonna use my little paper snips here to undo the shrink wrapping. And I do love the paper pumpkin kits. They are designed as a, like a 30 minute creative escape. And these um, card and crafting kits are designed with a similar thought in mind. Uh, they are great for portable crafting. They're also wonderful because they're all inclusive except for your paper snips and your bone folder. Okay, those are the only two items really that you might want to add on here with you. But we open it up. We have a Coastal Cabana Stampin' Spot, my absolute favorite color. So these are mini ink pads. All right, they're little one inch squares. All right, so perfect. Our ink is right there. We have an adorable stamp set. And this one has Let's see, thank you, it means so much. We've got, you're amazing. Uh, you made my day special. My day is better because of you. And then of course, a little smile, which the kit is named after. There's a starfish, a sand dollar, and some coral on there as well. Okay, and then as you can see, all the contents are in here. So uh, these make great gifts. Um, you can reuse the box afterwards. Um, they're, they're fantastic. And this kit even has a little block already in here too. So everything is shrink wrapped for you. This kit is $19 and it contains enough supplies to make eight mini cards. All right, so these cards are not able to be mailed through the US Postal Service as is. Um, rather, I mean, you'd have to put them in a bigger envelope if you wanted to do that. Um, but they are perfect for gifting, um, what I plan to use them for, which is why we brought one of the reasons we brought this along, um, they are great if you are leaving um, tips for your housekeeping or um, any of the, the staff that go above and beyond, you know, if you're on a trip that make your trip special. Um, if you are cruising, this would be something wonderful to take along that you could leave tips for your room steward and um, your bar staff, other people that, that really make your trip special. Um, but I love this. All right, this is super cute. Look at this cute little pocket envelope that we have. This stores our finished cards at the end. So I'm gonna set this aside. Check how cute these little envelopes are. Of course, they're Coastal Cabana. I love the little seashells 
on the sides there, and the little wood grain. Okay, so these cards and envelopes, the cards when folded are two and a quarter by three and a half. So they really are mini cards. And then the envelopes are just a little bit bigger because the card holder here is three and five sixteenth by four and 11 sixteenth. Okay, but the nice thing is, like I said, they're all inclusive. It came with the ink spot, the envelopes. We've got our cards here. So we've got two each of four designs. We've got this wood grain with the sand on the bottom, this fun beachy design here. Two of this one with like the ombre background. And then we've got another two beachy ones there. All right, and then I'm just scrolling through the comments. Hey, Becky, welcome. This is one of our all-inclusive craft kits. These are cool. These are glitter die cuts, right? And seashells and um, starfish there. Actually, in our little, we took a beach walk last night. I almost stepped on a jellyfish. It's one of the cannonball jellyfish. They are, they are not um, poisonous, um, but they do wash up on the beach here in uh, South Carolina sometimes. And um, so we've got some little die cut tags. We've got palm trees. Oh my goodness, these are so cute. Die cut palm trees and palm leaves. All right, we've got some vellum coral pieces. Those are pretty neat. Again, already die cut. Um, you get your mini glue dots, a stamping block. So this is like the paper pumpkin block. It's a little bit thinner. Um, but again, it's included in the kit. And then we've got some twine. So everything is all here. Chipboard to protect your work surface and then our card instructions as well. Hello, Elaine, welcome, welcome. All right, so taking a look at our craft kits while I'm here at the beach. All right, so I thought these would be perfect. And again, if you need a little creative escape or a reason to treat yourself, then um, these craft kits are nice. They're not super time consuming or anything. And it's nice if you don't want supplies taking over your house, then just a little box that you can keep them in and reuse is perfect. So let's go ahead and I thought we'd just make one of each. This is the A Little Smile card kit. Again, these are not in the catalog. These are only found in the online store, the stampinup.com online store. Okay, or use my link, whatever, um, however you wanna do that there. All right, this is item number 156. 982 it's $19 and then we've got some instructions here all right so they are going to let's work through this they are going to have us work on card number one here is the one with this ombre kind of greenish pool party background and we need one of our coral vellum die cuts here. So I'm gonna gently pop that out. Looks like I've got just a little piece on the inside. So we'll pop that, okay. So we've fold this in half. They are really cute. So they're perfect for tucking, you know, maybe a couple dollars in or something or using as a little, um, you know, gift card with, um, you know, if you're going to a, a shower or party or something like that and need a little gift. Okay, we also need one of our one of our sparkly starfish, and we need one of our die cut palm leaves here. Okay, so it looks like, and then and then just oh, one of these, the one with the um, kind of the wood grain on it here has a bit of a nautical feel. All right, so what we're going to do is take these little mini glue dots. All right, if you've got your own glue dots, you're welcome to use those, but whatever works for you. Okay, so we're going to take this. I don't think there is a right or wrong side to that, but it asks us to apply just a couple of these little glue dots here. I guess do the best you can and um, kind of put them I mean, they do end up clear, so they're not really gonna be noticeable. All right, I'm gonna just 
flick the ends off of those. Like I said, it's all inclusive. What you would need is possibly your paper snips as well as maybe a bone folder. Okay, so this is gonna go right in the center of our little note card. This is gonna make two each of four designs. So we have design number one here. Then we are going to take our starfish and they do give us a little diagram of where to put your glue dots. All right, so we'll put a couple of glue dots on our starfish. Let's go with the wider part there. And then we'll kind of space it out a little bit. Again, I'm using my, if you've got fingernails, then good for you. <laughs> I am in desperate need of a mani-pedi. I told David if we're gonna be down here, that is something that is on my bucket list is to get myself a manicure, or at least a pedicure. All right, and then we'll take our palm leaves here. Actually, I want the one, so they do go in two different directions. I want the one that's gonna go off towards the left. So we'll save that one for the next project. Okay, so this one just gets a glue dot right in the middle of the palm leaf. Okay, so then this comes out from our starfish. All right, then we've got our little label here and we're going to use our a little smile sentiment. So we'll just pop this off our block, or excuse me, off our stamp sheet, attach it to our block. And now when it comes to using the little ink spots, it's definitely easier to hold these in your hand and apply the ink directly to your stamp, okay? And then you can make sure that you've got enough ink on there. We're going to stamp that right in the center there. Okay, just a little smile. And then we'll put three little glue dots along the back. See how quick and cute these are? And of course, if you're on vacation and you're staying someplace, the staff, you know, especially the housekeepers and things, they work so hard and they don't make much money. So it's really nice to be able to pass on just a little token of appreciation for all that they do. All right, and then we've got our twine here. So we'll add just a little bit. Hey, Lori, welcome, welcome, how are you? All right, so let's see if we can find the end of our twine. All right, that wasn't too hard. I'm gonna unravel this a bit because it's easier to work with if you're not, not right down at the end. And so we're gonna do a little bow. So we're gonna make our bunny ear one go around, what do you say, around the tree? <laughs> and then through the hole and then pull tight, pull tight. Okay, so once you've got your knot, then you can adjust your loops, adjust your little ears, okay? All right, so then hold the center and then just keep adjusting your loops until you get it how you want it. All right, and we'll trim that off. We don't need it quite that long. And then Instead of applying your glue dot, um, trying to pick that up with your bow, go ahead and take your dot, put it right where you want it. So it's gonna be at the base of our starfish and our palm branch, right there above our smile. And then we can press the knot, press the knot into the dot. And there you have it. Is that not the cutest little card? So sweet. Love that. Hi, Sharon. Welcome. Hello, everyone. All right. So if you're just joining, this is the A Little Smile all-inclusive crafting kit from Stampin' Up. So this is card number one. These are a couple of mini cards. All right. So now we're going to move on to card number two. And card number two uses the design here so we've got wood grain with like a little bit of like a sandy rippled edge here 
All right, so this is card number two. We are going to need a palm tree, and it looks like, okay, so we've got two different palms. We've got the ones with the sand attached, and then just the single palm. So we need just a single. Okay, and then we are going to need, let's see, some of our vellum die cuts. We need a coral piece, so we're gently pop this up. These are actually pretty sturdy. Okay, so I've got a palm tree and a piece of coral, and then we need a sparkly sand dollar here. And then we need a single, a white label here. Okay, so we've got all of our little pieces. Got a little palm tree hopped on the floor. All right, so I'll pick that up before I step on it. All right, so we've got all of our little pieces. This time we are going to use the You Are Amazing sentiment. All right, let's see which one is that. Okay, down here. So the nice thing with these kits, this one makes um, eight cards, two each of four designs. These are mini cards, but then you do have your stamp set and um, pieces to work with after that. All right, so we're using our Coastal Cabana ink spot, applying our ink directly to our spot. We'll stamp our sentiment here. You are amazing. There we go. I think it's amazing that I stamped that straight. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. All right. So now essentially what we're going to do is we're going to flip over all of our pieces, apply all of our little mini dots here, and then we'll assemble our card. So the first one is our palm tree and it gets dots at the base in the leaves and then on the tree trunk. Okay, so then we'll just kind of pop these off. All right, so you could totally go rogue and get creative and make your own designs with this. Uh, this, a little smile, this beachy kit would work perfectly. We've got our, um, our seashell bundle. We've got, um, we've got the under the sea. We've got some additional palm tree stamp sets. We've got a lot of tropical prints in both our annual and our mini catalog. Um, so you could totally combine this with some of our other Stampin' Up! supplies. Um, but the nice thing too is that if you're short on time, these are, they really are designed to be all-inclusive, quick and easy. So they'd be a fun um, group activity. It's something you could also do with, with your friends or with kids. All right, or like I'm doing, you could bring it um, while you're traveling. All right, so you could take it to the beach, you could take it on a cruise, you could take it camping, whatever your getaway of choice is. Okay, so we put our little coral on there, add our little sparkly sand dollar. We're kind of doing a little collage effect here. All right, hey Pam, hello, hello. Thank you for sharing. Yes. Hello, everyone. Okay. So let's see here. Wendy says she uses the craft kits um, to stamp with her daughter. Absolutely. So fun. Great to do with her daughter, her sister, her grandma. Um, I like to craft with my niece. All those things. So good. All right. So we've got our sentiment. We already stamped our sentiment. So we're just going to put a couple of little glue dots across the back of this. So like I said, the only additional supplies I had to bring to go with this, I brought my paper snips and I did bring my bone folder, although these cards are kind of tiny, so I haven't even needed that. Um, so love that, really, really great. Okay, and put our little sentiment right here across across the middle, somewhat the middle of the card there. So we've got our coral as well as our sand dollar 
peeking through. Now, of course, you could also pull in your own dimensionals and um, kind of forego the glue dots on that. And if you wanna do a little bit of twine, add another little bow, all right, find the end, <laughs> make your loop, pinch it, go around, pull through, pull tight, grab your knot, and then, then slowly adjust your loops. Okay, so you always wanna start just a little bit bigger and then you can make them smaller or adjust them however you want. And then we'll trim the end. So this part you do need some snips for if you're gonna use the twine. Okay, and then go ahead, place your glue dot on the card where you would like your bow. All right, do not try to stick that directly to your twine. That's probably not gonna work out real well. Put your knot, put your dot on your card first and then put your knot on the dot. How cute. Pam says she made these to give away to wait staff when they went out to eat and they loved them, absolutely. So even if you're not necessarily vacationing, sweet little um, notes of kindness, perfect for making someone's day. Uh, yeah, if you go out to eat, you could pass them out. Uh, maybe as you go to the bank, whether you see the bank teller or go through the drive-through, um, the cashier when you're checking out at the store, um, all those people, essential workers, especially they've worked through the pandemic, they've got tough jobs. <laughs> they deal with everyone's crap. <laughs> and um, if we tell them thank you and give them a little, a little something to brighten their day, boy, a little, a little smile goes a long way, absolutely. Hi, Kathy, thank you so much for joining. So we're using the A Little Smile All-Inclusive Craft Kit by Stampin' Up! here. All right, so we have done cards one and two. They're super cute. These are mini cards. So again, these are, I believe, two, the direct, excuse me, the dimensions are on the website. So they're two and a quarter by three and a half. So they are quite tiny. Uh, these would also make really cute little embellishments on a scrapbook page. You could attach this to your page and then put your journaling inside. That would be really cute. Ooh, just gave myself a fun idea. Especially this is National Scrapbooking Month. So is anybody scrapbooking too? Leave me a comment and let me know. All right, so we are going to move on to card number three. All right, so we're doing one of each. Card number three has the sand and then of course our little water there at the bottom. All right, so for this one, we are going to use our little vellum coral piece. So from what I can tell, we're gonna have extra pieces. So a couple extra coral left over. If you were to make all eight cards, you'd still end up with a few leftovers. Okay, we need Let's see, we need one of our wood grain tags and we need our palm leaf that goes off to the right. And we're gonna need a little bow. All right, so otherwise, oh, and a sand dollar, a sparkly sand dollar. Okay. All right, so with these pieces here, then we're going to use Thank you, thank you, it means so much for this one. Of course, if you're making this kit for you, you could um, use whatever sentiments um, work best for you, but we have a smile in here, you're amazing, thanks so much, you made my day special, um, my day is better because of you, all really positive and upbuilding um, notes of appreciation on there. Okay, so for this, we are going to add on our coral first. So we'll put a glue dot at the base of our coral. All right, so if you've used our crafting kits, let me know. I've heard from Wendy and Pam how they enjoy using them. So let me know if you've used one. All right, or which kit is your favorite? We've got quite a few. We've probably got a good dozen in the online store right now. Stampin' Up! adds a new one just about every month which is pretty cool. They just added um, 
a thank you one that's got hearts and leaves and all kinds of, it's really pretty. Um, that one just came out, I'd already placed my order. So that one will have to go on my next order. All right, but for right now, especially since we're traveling and I've got beach on the mind, I chose this A Little Smile kit. I also picked up a kit that's called You Are My Anchor that also has a nautical theme to it. All right, so we've got these on here. Aren't they cute? Oh, Lori says she is slowly working on a Disney World scrapbook for her son and their family trip to Disney that they took last November. Oh, Lori, that's exciting. How awesome and good for you. I know I do better at scrapbooking, um, doing scrapbooking themed gifts for friends and family. I do better at that than I do at scrapbooking for myself because I think, of course, as a, as a crafter, my own projects always, <laughs> always fall to the wayside a little bit, but I have done several, um, like bridal and baby shower themed albums for my girlfriends and cousins and, and everything that that's always, that's been a lot of fun. Um, did an album uh, for when my grandparents were alive. I did a nice um, family album for them, uh, which is a nice memory. We still have that, still have that book that I made. And um, no, scrapbooking is wonderful and I just, I don't do enough of it, but that is one of my goals for this month. I actually did bring, I did bring, we drove, I didn't fly. So we drove, uh, which meant I was able to pack a few extra paper crafting supplies with me. Um, and so I did bring the palm tree um, paper, but the sweet from the mini catalog, which one is that um, awesome, Hmm. I'll, have to, I'll have to let you know. <laughs> the palm tree one, stay tuned. <laughs> Maybe I'll have some pages to show you next week. <laughs> uh, Wendy says she has some photos from 30 years ago when they were at Disney in California and she's always wanted to scrapbook them. Well, there you go. We'll have to get Lori to post in our, um, in my Just Be Cardiology um, paper crafting group there here on Facebook. And <laughs> Maybe you guys can share ideas. I've seen some cute ones on Pinterest doing little punch art to make, of course, your your mouse ears and things like that, with just um, using circle punches. It doesn't have to be overly complicated, but it can be a lot of fun. All right, so we are moving on to our fourth design here. All right, so this one, is this the right card? Let's see here. I think we've got one. I just did that one. I've done one of those. Okay, I think my, there we go, the fourth card design. I was like, there's two each of four, so I should have some left over here. All right, this fun one, of course you can tell we've got the sky and the water here. All right, this is where we get to use the palm tree with that fun beach connection there. All right, we are going to use a starfish and then we'll use one more piece of coral here. All right, then we just need a plain white tag and a bow. You know, I never put the bow on the last card. <laughs> All right, well, so we'll, we'll wrap up our bows here um, when I'm done with this one. Okay, so for this, we're going to attach our palm beach scene first. So we'll make sure that we put some glue dots here on the palm leaves, as well as at the base. And they only have us putting a couple on. I really, I like to, I like to overdo it just a little bit with my adhesive because I wanna make sure that nothing comes apart. All right, especially if um, you know you gift this to somebody and it's totally unexpected, then chances are they're gonna save your little card because it's such a surprise and it means so much to them. Um, down here, 
at our place in, in Myrtle Beach for years, years and years we had um, the same woman that was in charge of, of housekeeping for our particular um, condo unit here. She was the sweetest. She um, actually retired here, I think, um, during the pandemic. And, um, but we loved her and I would always give her handmade cards and she would tell me she would keep them on the mantle at her home. And <laughs> it just meant so much to her. So you never know. Uh, this kit is called a little smile, but you know, not only will it make somebody smile, but they might just cherish your your card for for years to come. All right, so put our little coral on there. We're gonna put our little sand dollar on here as well. Okay. All right, so they're gonna kind of overlap a little bit. I haven't really seen any starfish on the beach here in Myrtle Beach. Um, a lot of shells like mussels and things like that and, and the little tiny shells and even a jellyfish, but I have not seen any starfish. Okay, so for this one, we're going to use the My Day is Better Because of You. Well, I think any day is better when you're at the beach. <laughs> All right. So we'll ink up our little, I love that I've got a Coastal Cabana mini ink spot, my favorite color. And now I have both a full size and a mini pad. Perfect. This color itself just makes me happy. All right, so I'm gonna stamp our sentiment on here. Okay. And then we'll put a couple of dots on the back of this. And then, all right, then remind me, I need to put the bows, the little linen thread bows on this card as well as the previous. All right, so this one we're going to put our sentiment, you know, I'm going to kind of tuck this right under there because I love the little sparkle from the starfish. Let's overlap it just a little bit. All right, then we'll take our linen thread. We'll do our little loop, go around, pull through. Okay. Oh, that loop got really big. All right, so you can always pull it smaller. All right, then use your snips snips to kind of trim that off. All right, then we'll put our little mini glue dot. This is gonna go kind of right over here at the base of the tree. And then stick your knot to the dot. Okay, cute. And I love that linen thread on there. It's, nice. it's so cute, nautical, kind of beach theme with that. I'm gonna trim it just a little bit a little bit shorter here so it doesn't fall off the card. All right, let me pull in, let's see, because I missed the little glue dot, the bow for this card. All right, so we're gonna put one of these. This one's gonna go right up here, kind of at the base of that palm leaf. All right, so we'll do our little bow for this one as well. Again, adjust your loops. Okay, let's see, yeah, those are cute. Okay. All right, so don't, don't go away yet because I want to show you guys a cute little holder for these. All right, so there we have it. We have all four of our A Little Smile mini cards. So, so sweet. Oh, Dora says, looks very nice and inviting. And I could use those. Oh, <laughs> Dora says that maybe I could use them as invitations to our place. Well, absolutely. <laughs> Good idea. Hi, Susan. Hello, everyone. All right, so we have this cute 
little holder here. It's even got the little seashell coral theme on it. All right, cute little pocket envelope. What I'm gonna do is, um, since there's two of each, so I've got four cards yet left, we're just gonna fold these nicely. All right, so I'm gonna tuck these in the little envelope. I'm gonna tuck in our finished cards. All right, so these are just the perfect, perfect size for handing somebody a tip or, or leaving them, you know, a nice gratuity or something. All right, then we've got our adorable little envelopes, Coastal Cabana. I'm gonna fold over the flaps here. All right, so we've got Coastal Cabana. So the colors in this are Coastal Cabana, Crumb Cake, and Old Olive. That is the color scheme. All right, those cute. They've got a little tropical print there on the flap as well. Okay, so we'll take these and tuck them inside. Don't you love how, look how that expands nicely. So it fits all eight cards and envelopes in there. And then I've got my remainder of my glue dots with my ink spot, the block and the stamp set. And then you could even um, punch out your extra pieces if you wanted to, if you weren't ready to, you know, to finish all of your cards yet. You could probably tuck all of those little pieces in there too, in which case everything condenses down pretty much this nice little um, a little gift pocket and then it's got a cute little um here we go let's see get my thumb under there just to okay pick it up so we'll run our thread come on here there we go I just need to get it caught underneath and then you can wrap it around cutest little thing ever absolutely adorable and then of course you still have the rest of the box to do whatever you like um again reuse it and um and you have room for more more craft kits but what a perfect little crafting experience just 19 dollars, and um everything you need is is right here all ready to go for you perfect so I hope you check out the little craft kits that are in the online store there. Love those. They all um, show you the exact picture, okay? And then they do show you exactly what is included. But um, I love the all-inclusive ones because you get a unique stamp set for each kit, all right? You get your block, everything is in here. So perfect for crafting on the go, quick crafting uh, with yourself or a friend or family member, or, and they make great gifts as well. So don't forget to take a little bit of a time for some self-care, um, crafting, scrapbooking, card making, all of these things are so important for, <laughs> we need that just for our mental health, just to get away a little me time, preserve some of those memories of friends and family. and. Um, all of that wonderful stuff so i hope you guys have a fabulous afternoon wherever you are and a great weekend as well and um i hope you've enjoyed today's video yes i enjoyed this was so much fun to do these little craft kits and everything is is all set very little mess i i did kind of spread things out but look at that all nice and tidy and boom i don't really have much to clean up at all so that is a plus as well. <laughs> All right, thank you guys so, so much. Again, don't forget to head over to my online store. Make sure you use my host code and shop this week to get my Hues of Happiness six card kit to each of three designs there. You get the kit free. This is a kit that I've made um, that you'll get free with a $65 order. And you'll also get your name in the drawing for one of my free bundle giveaways as well. So thank you, thank you. Happy stamping to all of you. Have a great, great weekend. Thank you all. And yes, I'll be sure to try to share some, some pictures from the beach as well. All right, take care everybody. Bye-bye. <laughs>